Hello ladies and gentlemen, Holotide here, and today I want to do something that a lot of you have been asking me to kind of uh, showcase mods and things like that on the channel, especially with Infinite kind of being in a lull right now. And that's exactly what I'm going to do. I saw this on my timeline. This is a campaign mission-esque thing that you can do on CE, and it is called Facility. I will leave a link to the mod in the description down below. This mod was posted on March 18th. So it's still, you know, relatively new. It's been out for a month. And the creator's description says, What you're in is an alternate universe in the 1950s where the Covenant attacked with the small fleet on Earth. The war has been devastating all around Earth, and a military research organization is experimenting with the technology they found on wrecked Covenant ships and bodies, finding new ways to use their armors and weapons. You got word from your captain about a classified facility being attacked and your objective is to eliminate all hostiles, but you soon find out that it's something way more terrifying. They also credit Resistance 2, and I definitely get the vibes of that in this game. I will also say that I played on easy mode and I was getting absolutely wrecked. And he says, or she says, that the map is co-op, but keep in mind, stick together if you do play co-op. You don't want to be stuck in an early BSP, I'm not sure what that means, for an eternity. So I was enjoying my time with this mod. Unfortunately, my, I guess, game crashed at the end while I was recording this. So I'm going to go back and finish it. But I'm going to try to make it as spoiler-free as possible. I will say you, it is kind of stressful navigating everything. It all kind of feels the same. But um, I don't think that that's a knock on the mod. And it's definitely not like Halo, Halo, if you catch my drift. Again, this is, you know, the 1950s, so it's like 500 years before Halo takes place. I'm pretty sure if math is mathin'. So the weapons and stuff are different, which isn't a bad thing. And you do find very unique weapons later on in the mission. Speaking of unique, I want to talk about today's sponsor, Raid Shadow. I'm just kidding. It's not Raid Shadow. I don't have any sponsors. In fact, the I'm going to sponsor myself. If you enjoy Halo videos and whatnot like that, make sure you subscribe. I know like 90% of you who watch my videos aren't subscribed, so we're trying to hit 15k. This is a Halo haven. Anyways, again, I really enjoyed my time with this mod. I'm, I'm definitely going to keep looking around for new ones. I'm going to let this play out a little bit so you can kind of get a feel for the mod. But again, go check it out. It, you know, it's super easy now to, to do mods with Steam Workshop and uh, how it's integrated with the MCC. And honestly, I think there's a lot of hackers or something on there as well. So, you know, playing PvE content, not so bad. But that's going to do it for the video, ladies and gentlemen. If you enjoyed, make sure you leave a like down below. If you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe, and I will catch you around the ring. Peace!